Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back here to another edition of The Fishing Teacher, and thanks a lot for taking some time to check the video out. Guys, today I'm gonna to give you guys some tips and advice on how to fish this Mega Bass Flap Slap, flat-sided crankbait. Guys, this is one of my favorite crankbaits of all time. I've been using it for, man, probably eight or 10 years now, and it's just one of the best lures I've ever seen for catching quality fish. So we're gonna have a little bit of a, of a seminar here on it. Um, first of all, guys, um, the flap slap is, uh, it looks just like a thread fin shad. I mean, it's super, super realistic. Comes in a lot of different colors here. And it's actually with the lip design on it. This bait will, is designed to run probably three to five foot deep on anywhere between eight to 12 pound test line, depending upon the length of your cast and all that type of stuff. But guys, this is one of the most effective year round crankbaits I've ever fished. One of the biggest sacks of fish I ever caught in my entire life was at Lake Gunnersville in Alabama on this thing uh, during late March, early April. Um, it's really good, and I don't care if you're fishing it around rocky banks, riprap over grass beds, next to docks, anything like that. It's super, super effective. Now, there's a couple different ways you can work it. I call this thing, it, you can fish it as a crankbait, but I like to use what's called the reel and pull technique, almost like a jerk bait. So what I'll do is I'll cast it out there, and I'll just start reeling it steady, and a lot of times I'll just twitch my rod as I'm wheeling it, just twitch it a little bit. And sometimes I'll pull it like that where it just goes like that for a little bit. And sometimes I'll just softly jerk it like a jerk bait because the lip design and the profile of this is sort of almost like a short stubby jerk bait. So you can either reel it just, you know, across like that, or you can jerk it back, back and forth. It just depends on what the, the fish want to, uh, how they want to bite it. But um, I think also Edwin Evers, uh, Ever, Edwin Evers, uh, I think he was leading the Bassmasters Classic at Gunnersville on this a couple of years ago. Um, I just absolutely love it, guys. So um, I'll put the uh, Bait Works link in the description if you're ordered, interested in ordering some. You guys can get them through there. Um, but a couple of different situations I'll talk about as far as just talk about water clarity and specific type of areas. Um, the thing about the flap slap that I found that works the best, even though it, it even though it's realistic and looks like a shad, I have not done that great on it in really clear water. So I don't use it much if the water visibility is like over four foot. In, in that situation, I'll go to more just a straight jerk bait. But when you're talking about water visibility is anywhere between say maybe a foot and a half to like three, three and a half feet, this is ideal. And in a lot of the lakes across the country, that's sort of the visibility that you have is that two to three foot range works really good in those situations. And weather conditions produces in all different conditions, windy, calm, sunny, cloudy. This is a quiet bait. It doesn't have rattles in it, so it doesn't telegraph itself a lot. The, the only telegraphing that it has is through the tight vibration that it has. It doesn't have like a super tight vibration, but I would call it like a medium type tight uh, vibration. So anyway, guys, give them a try. Mega Bass Flap Slap. Um, this is just another category of the flat side crankbait. We'll be talking more about this. Plastic lure is a plastic body. Lots, some flat sides are made out of wood, but this particular one is a uh, plastic. So anyway, I just wanted to pass it along, guys. I just caught so many good fish on it. I think it's a bait that you guys would definitely uh, do well to have in your box. So hope it helps out. We'll see you later.